I'd like to call this meeting to order the September 4th. 4th. Correct this agenda. September 4th meeting of the Miami Township Board of Trustees. I'd entertain a motion to adopt our minutes of August 19th. I'll second, I mean, I'll, make, I'll move that we adopt our minutes. I'll second that. I'll put 2024 there. Call roll, please. Uh, it's been moved and seconded to adapt the minutes of August 19, 2024. As presented, uh, Ms. Moyer? Yes. Mr. Hollister? Yes. Minutes are adopted. I'm going to entertain a motion to approve payment of bills totaling $39,819.78. Of that, from the general fund is $9,225.32. For cemetery, $3,188.79. Fire fund, $22,764.55. Road fund, $4,641.12. I move that we pay our bills. I second that motion. Any discussion? Um, I have none. Please call the roll. It's been moved and seconded to approve payment of bills in the amount of $39,819.78 as enumerated. Ms. Moyer? Yes. Mr. Hollister? Yes. The motion is approved. Uh, any additions to the agenda? Our this being a Wednesday meeting rather than our normal Monday meeting, because Monday was Labor Day. Uh, our fire chief forgot uh, the meeting change and he is getting, uh, he has a medical appointment at this moment. Uh, so he is not here to give the fire department report. Similarly, uh, no one here to give cemetery or road report. I have something for that. Okay. Dan says he's going on vacation to Ireland September 19th through October 3rd, so he won't be around. Brandon, Brandon will be here. Okay. And he says the grass is getting cut and the cemetery is getting spicked up and nothing, um, nothing spectacular or remarkable to report. And the grass is growing slower because there's no rain. Mm -hmm. uh, we have nothing from the fiscal officer. I mean, we have documents, but no oral report. And because Trustee Chris Mutcher could not be here. Uh, Nick Budis was planning to come from Glen Helen and he will instead come on September 16th when Chris, who's got the most history with uh, Glen Helen and, well, with uh, the uh, Grinnell, Mill. Grinnell Mill. We own the Grinnell Mill. Yeah little known fact. So that new business item is being bumped to September 16th. Any um, old business? Anything for zoning? Zoning. Um, I, got, I got a zoning administrator on the line. I'm trying to reel him in. Um, that is applicant. Applicant. And um, everything went well with every, patching all the hearings and permits and things together. Um, Carrie Smith's really come through with us and gave an extra helping us. That's all. Anything else, Sony? What else, Sony? Fred? Uh, just a question from the public. I personally have difficulty understanding 
the formal ways to communicate with the Zoning Commission. So I'm asking a question of the Township Trustees. Is it permissible for a resident of the Township to address a letter to the Zoning Commission in care of the Miami Township Trustees? Yes. Thank you. And you brought up something else, Fred, and that is um, not being able to communicate easily by email. For years, we had their emails on the site. When the people started coming to their meetings and sending a lot, they said, oh, you know, they're taking it back, it's my personal email. I believe we should, I, I need to create uh, one that says like zoning commission and have it, have it, um, at you know miamitownship.net and have, have it go to the the chair and he could distribute it as as needed but yeah that's absolutely um essential that the public be able to get their thoughts to them um, but until we do that and send it care of trust township trustees yes. oh i i I have a related question to that. It may not be in the purview of the township trustees, but I notice when the township trustees get correspondence, I often see it listed in your agenda and in some way therefore recorded that you have received a particular communication. I wonder, I am not seeing that occur in my limited experience with the Miami Township Zoning Commission, I wonder if there are any rules or procedures or organizational routines that allow them to keep track of any correspondence that they get and perhaps also record it or file it in an organizational way. This is a question that maybe does not belong in this session, but I thought I'd ask it. I have nothing. I mean, do you, do you have a? Not an immediate answer, but other than to say that whatever they receive is public record. And yeah, you should and have some, some, some way of Some way of acknowledging it or some way of keeping it or those are not requirements of that particular organization i don't know the law i do believe the zoning commission has bylaws the, the bza does not yet have bylaws i think the zoning commission does um that's a good thing for me to ask brian because they have been getting correspondence and it is public record and i wonder if they could produce it if asked so he should be Definitely be aware of that just so the information is shared, but also because Public of Information Act um, would allow someone to um, get anything that they were given. Yeah. To inquire of that record? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Well, I plead ignorance. Uh, yeah, well, thank you for bringing this up. Just yeah. asking for guidance. We will pursue. Thank you. Anything else for the good of the order? For zoning. Um, well, for the meeting at all, not just for zoning. Um, not zoning, standing committees, not new business, Nick Buddhist isn't here, old business. I asked. A lot going on, nothing really to handle in decision making right now. I have. I need to uh, make you aware that I will not be attending the next meeting. Okay. Um, I will be out of town. I, I'm happy to do the minutes from video because I understand that that, would, that will be what's happening. I'll make sure you get these ahead of time. Mm -hmm. But then I'll do the uh, 16th minutes from the video. Okay. And, and if I wish to, if I wish to read through the minutes of the last meeting that will now be published in a place where I may see them? The draft is, I, I always put the draft on the website now. Okay. We, have, we have new, a little bit new procedures for that and I do file them usually by the end of the week. However, that will not happen this week because of the late meeting. So by the end of next week, they will be up. 
Thanks for educating me again. Well, if there's nothing else, I will adjourn this meeting at 5.12.